So Devon, as a culture expert person, one of my question for you is a lot of times uh, I tell my uh, clients that have a value alignment between yourself and the company you are applying so that if their value is creativity and your value is creativity, that there's a match. But how important that value alignment should be? Is it 80%, 100%? And we know that during COVID times or maybe after, people are struggling and they need a paycheck. And maybe they will not think about value alignment because I need money now to pay the bills to have food on the table. So what tips do you have for job seeker in, the, in terms of value alignment? Yeah, well, I would say this. If I'm a job seeker, this is the most highly educated workforce we've had. Yeah. So I'm not going to settle. If I had to go through the interview process, I look at your website, I glean the internet, and I start to get the sense that maybe you lack diversity. If I look at your senior leadership team, and they look not unlike me, maybe I'm a you know maybe I'm a 26 year old female, and I don't see any women on the leadership team, or maybe I see all Caucasian people. I see a lack of diversity. That's mm -hmm. okay. I guess maybe there's a value right there. I don't see me there. Mm -hmm. I go through the interview process. I don't see me again. There's another knock. So, ab so, so many opportunities. So values matter. They always have mattered. And I think they matter more now because you can't hide behind it. I have more choices. I'm more educated. I'm more skilled. And if you don't create an environment where I can thrive and your values aren't aligned with me, then guess mm -hmm. what? I don't, I don't go or I do not stay. Yeah. And what about the other way around? So sometimes job seekers do the interview and then they get an email from the recruiter or the hiring manager saying that, thank you very much for coming, we like you, but culturally you're not fit. What does that mean? Does it mean that they don't have diversity inclusion strategy? Does it mean that if they are creative and this person is not creative and they want to create mini me? So what are your thoughts if the other way around happens? Yeah, so for the most part, it's pretty subjective, right? So culture is very nebulous. Mm -hmm. We talk culture, but what does that mean? Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean much. Culture to me is a series of norms and behaviors. Yes. So you can have core values on the wall, integrity, yeah. creativity, trustworthiness. But unless I can specifically articulate what those look like in terms of behavior, yeah. they're hollow. Mm -hmm. Right? So, yeah. so... So in other words, so if, I'm, if I'm an employer and, and these are my core values, then I need to be talking about it. I need to be training it. I need to be showing what this looks like. So in other words, internally, this is what it looks like to live our core values. Yes. So what I look to do is move beyond an intellectual exercise. Yes. Knowing is never enough. How are we going to live it? So for example, so what are our meetings? How do we make our meetings more? If, if say inclusion was a core value. How do we make our meetings more inclusive? How do we do that? How do we amplify? How do we amplify more voices? All right. What does trustworthiness look like? Okay. So I would look for opportunities to operationalize the core values. Mm -hmm. I say that again. Operationalize. If I'm not seeing it, hearing it, or living it, the values don't exist. Yeah. I heard one time a manager was telling me, or a speaker was telling me that in, in, during their meetings. At the beginning, they talk about one of the values and how that's being implemented or what actions they are doing so that it's, as you mentioned, being uh, living the value and not just being on the wall. Absolutely. So I'll give you an example. We were, I was in a meeting the other day with someone and they started the Zoom meeting and they asked a question to all the teammates. The question was to everyone on the Zoom meeting, what teammate has been the most helpful to you this week? Mm -hmm. Kindness is one of their core values. Yeah. Everyone sat there, they processed. Oh, yeah. Oh. Wrote it down and yeah. then they shared. Yeah. It took five minutes, but people clearly saw that kindness matters. Yeah. If I'm not asking about it, obviously not that important. Not happening. Yeah. Those are great tips, Devon. I appreciate that. Again, for the audience watching or listening, if you have any other tips, please leave comments below and tune in next time for another great question with Devon.